What's up guys, it's Alex. Today we're gonna be checking out Siamel and Ernie Zachary Goodbye Hello official music video. I've reacted to Ernie Zachary in the past, but I've never actually listened to anything from Siamel. But what from you guys have told me, apparently Ernie Zachary and Siamel are actually married. They're a married couple and they're both singers and they uh, put out music together. I don't know about you guys, but I think that's so cool. Like being in a married, like being in a relationship and being able to perform with your significant other and make music with them, like that's really cool. They seem to have a lot of work together actually. They have another song called Aku Tinta and they perform that live on AJL. So I might have to watch that after this one. But today, let's check out Goodbye Hello and see what that sounds like. Rocket Fuel. I feel like they're a really big company because I see them all the time in a lot of videos. Oh. Goodbye, hello. They have different beds. Oh, are these two different houses? I just want to make you mine. Oh, I think they're in... Oh, they're texting each other? Every second you give to me. They're with each other? Every time you go, part of me is dying. Oh, did you see that? He was... That's kind of cute. <laughs> what happened? <laughs> Only God knows what's good for you and I. Oh, their voices are so good. Oh. Dang. They sound good. Yo, wait, I think that's so cute though. Like when you're talking to your crush, someone you like so much that you, you spill your milk, you don't even focus on the cereal. You're like, oh, I have yet to do that. This video makes me feel super single. Where's my girlfriend at, huh? <laughs> Flowers. Wait, I'm so confused though, because it looks like they're in the same house. Cause they only showed us one house in the beginning. Are they writing music? Oh, wait, there's so much going on. I don't even know what to talk about. I was gonna talk about their harmonies cause they sound really good together. But then I saw the wedding, the wedding book. And then Ernie all of a sudden went, ooh. Wedding cakes. Oh, the ring! Wait! Are they getting married? Cause the ring all white. Maybe this is the future when they're already married. Oh my gosh, this is so cute though. Wedding dress. <gasps> oh my, they're couple goals. Oh, so is this like traditional, um, like attire for attending weddings in uh, Malaysia? Oh, his voice? Yo, Siamel, calm down. He sounds so good though, hold up. Did you hear that rasp in his voice? Oh, yo, she has such a pretty voice. They're writing music together. Oh my gosh, why can't I have a girlfriend that I can write music with? Dang. 
Power. Hey. Hey. They're so cute. What the heck? Every time I say goodbye, you say hello. Wait, I think I understand what it means now. I think the reason why they were in one house is because they were talking about the future. Like what their future would be like together if they lived in the same house. That's why they started off in different locations. Like it looked like they were in different houses, but they were like texting each other and stuff. But then eventually they were in the same house. So it has to mean marriage. This song makes me feel very single <laughs> it's it's a really sweet song this is such a sweet song honestly these are the feelings that you experience when you're in love you know especially toward that point when you're about to get married that's when feelings that are, are like an all-time high like they're very high every time you go part of me is dying wow that's like but this is real love. Like, that's such a deep lyric. That's how you know it's real love. When you can't go on with the other, without the other person. When it feels like part of you is missing. So, it kind of feels like part of you is dying in a way. You know, that's kind of an extreme way to put it. But it's true sometimes. I unfortunately do not know what that feeling is like. Because I am painfully single. Uh... Any ladies out there watching this video and you want to change that, we can make it happen, you know. <laughs> There's so much like serotonin that I get through this video. Just watching, I don't know what it is, but I love weddings. I love seeing two people in love. I love seeing the process of a relationship when they start from the beginning and eventually the feelings grow even more. Just watching that happen, like I'm just like, it makes me so happy. I think the arrangement of this song definitely contributes to that. It's, it's such a light and pleasant song to listen to. The melodies are so bright and the way they're singing too, like when they're singing to each other, I'm like, dude, that's so romantic. They're really singing their hearts out and saying like, I am so happy to be with you. I am so glad that you are mine. Ernie Zachary has such a stylish way of singing. I love her runs and her riffs. And bro, Siam Mel, this is my first time listening to him, but his voice is so good. That rasp, I have to listen to more. I have to listen to Aku Chinta and I have to listen to the live performance. Before I get married, I'm sending this video to my future wife. This song, cause she needs to hear this song. I gotta add this to my wedding playlist. Anyways, y'all, what did you think about Siam Mel and Ernie Zachary's Goodbye, hello. If you guys like my reaction, make sure to hit the subscribe button and also like this video. If you guys want to see more reactions from me in the future, make sure to leave some suggestions in the comments and I'll try to get to that as soon as possible. I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace.